Hey there, welcome back. Jared here, um, and I'm here to uh, hopefully set the record straight uh, about the controversy surrounding uh, Black Ops 6's uh, audio, I guess, enhanced audio subscription. I've been seeing a lot of uh, articles and, and uh, videos popping up on like YouTube and everything and, and, and t uh, TikTok and whatnot, um, talking about how, you know, this is going to be a pay-to-win uh, subscription model uh, through uh, Black Ops. However, that it, according to them and according to other sources that I've seen, that is not necessarily the case. So, uh, if you're not aware, what I'm talking about is uh, there is a third-party company that uh, Black, uh, Black Ops or uh, uh, Treyarch has gone through. Um, called Embody, and uh, basically what they are offering is uh, in Black's, Black Ops' uh, website, uh, it actually talks about uh, how you can, it uses Embody's uh, tools to be able to be, uh, utilize basically a spatial audio, so you can get better um, like footsteps, uh, directional sounds, uh, basically everything's uh, how the audio bounces off of each and every, say, wall, couch, like off of certain objects, uh, and they, it, and it sounds more, li you know, lifelike. Um, wet, so, on their website, uh, it states that you, as a normal, uh, Black Ops user, they use a universal uh, profile across the board for everyone um, that gets to, so it, you get to utilize this uh, tool. Well, it, it, and they use like a universal setting. Whereas the subscription portion that everybody has been uh, talking about, um, they offer you a basically a $20 uh, purchase for basically a five-year subscription uh, for embodies uh, you get you get a personalized profile uh, specifically uh, for your ears so for your ear canal pretty much uh, what a lot of other uh, headphone users are doing uh, whereas if you want certain audio options, you have to pay up front to be able to utilize that. Um, now, there was one article that I saw uh, on uh, Games Radar, or sorry, GameSpot, and in there was talking about how Embody's tool was kind of similar to Final Fantasy, uh, Final Fantasy 14, where they used the this embodies tool for better audio quality, wh whereas uh, some people said when they had to purchase that, they didn't really notice the difference. You couldn't really hear the difference, um, and so a lot of people are kind of suspicious about that. So. We're not entirely sure how that is going to work out in this uh, scenario in this game. Now, one thing uh, a lot of people are saying is that they the it's the reason that it's pay to win is because whereas hey the people who get the universal model well they get just your standard Call of Duty you know sound quality whereas what people are uh, imagining or what which I can understand where they're coming from is they're saying that if you pay up front this twenty dollars well you get better sound quality and that better sound quality is gonna basically uh, allow you to hear you know footsteps like more accurately uh, where someone might be shooting from where voices are being heard uh, so the, the re that's why their people are saying hey this is gonna be pay to win because you're actually going to be able to find out hey where is this person where is this person where is this person 
Whereas in the universal model, people are thinking, oh, well, they're basically going to basically, basically lower the quality of sound that you're uh, getting for, uh, for the game itself. So hopefully that's not true. If, if we're basing it off of basically what I'm going off of is what uh, is based on it on what they are telling us and what we are getting is basically what uh, say uh, Dolby Atmos uses whereas you have you do have to pay uh, for their models because they are they use high quality sound like our audio codecs and they've been doing it for years and and uh, so what I found on uh, Reddit was actually uh, someone who was sounds a lot more intelligent than I do um, was just saying that you know it's not necessarily a paid add-on it is a paid third third-party tool um, that works directly with uh, Activision on their game um, now they're saying you know uh, Call of Duty games have been using spatial audio for years now, since it's about 20, 2019. Um, and right now, they're just, and part of those were uh, utilizing. So, what was it? Um, it is Call of Duty games si since Modern Warfare, you know, 2019, have supported spatial audio natively via the u use of the Microsoft Spatial Sound API and supports a native channel bed output of 7.1.4 to a home theater system, uh, Dolby Atmos or uh, DTSX uh, for home theater, entirely free of charge. This obviously includes the latest release of the new newest Black Ops 6. The so Black Ops 6 supports spatial audio, aka 7.1.4, natively free of charge, and has so have and so have prior uh, releases since 2019. <clears throat> so they already had that spatial audio, audio uh, there on their games, whereas now they're utilizing um, this tool, basically um, doing the same exact thing what they were doing before. It's just that $20 gives you a more specified audio profile specifically for your ear you know like your ear canal uh and like i said that's other headphone makers are already doing this granted that is you know part of their in some cases that is just happen to be part of their uh, headphone like what they're selling you that's just part of it uh whereas in this in this instance um they're claiming that they can do that with any uh, headphone. I, I would I would assume probably up to a certain, <laughs> you know, certain scenario. Like, to, but they're saying that they could use this tool on any headphone, and that's why you know, if you want a personalized profile for your audio, then they say here's a twenty dollar, you know, charge to do that and specifically align all the sound frequencies and everything speci specified for you. Now, they do give you, uh, I did see that the, you can do a 30-day th a free trial, then that way you can uh, test and see for yourself if you want, if uh, for the uh, universal portion of it, the universal model or uh, the personalized model uh, specified for you, so it does give you that option and if you do find it to be justified to go and spend that extra 20 uh, by all means I guess uh, go ahead for it you know go ahead with it and if you don't it's obviously it's not for you at that time so and and I, I really hope uh, <laughs> this doesn't come you know to it being like a pay to win type of uh, scenario especially since they are going to be adding this in uh, Warzone um, when that comes out so 
as long as they kind of stick to exactly what it's telling us then i think uh black ops call of duty basically i think they're in the clear on this one in my opinion but again we will see when it comes out uh tomorrow and that will kind of give us if uh if that is the case where it is a paid uh, win model then i guess uh they're they're gonna be uh, hurting because a lot of people are gonna uh, be angry at them um but i will uh link uh some of these articles down below um and hopefully this kind of helps um hopefully alleviates uh, some stress and anger uh, towards them and and again uh, like i said if it if it doesn't happen to be the case then i will come out with another video uh shaming them for uh going this that direction but um as soon as the game comes out i'll be uh, giving that a try and we'll get some uh, videos up for that as well um and i think uh that is it um again i'll put the link down below so you guys can uh, click on uh Look at some of those for yourself, kind of see, um, kind of get some, I guess, opinions uh, of your own on that. So, okay, I will uh, see you guys later. You guys have a good one.